but thanks for sure. They always bring the physicality. Natalie Simons, our center referee, and we are underway here this evening. 76 degrees and sunny at kickoff tonight with Katie Goodman and our entire crew. I'm Dan Weiss. Thanks for joining us here on Bally Sports. San Antonio FC in Orange County split the two-match series a year ago. SAFC winning here convincingly 4-0. Orange County got the better of SAFC in the final week of the regular season, winning 1-0 at Champion Stadium in 2022 with just seven wins. And then Chaplos dismissed. You can you can see the difference. One of the areas to that point, Katie, where SAFC's had success is being able to find those loans that have fit their program. Tani Oluwashi, a perfect example, a guy who wasn't getting... And in their two opportunities where Amon got upended and Bonnie took away the chance from Scott and that's going to be a yellow here on Tater Hawkinson I would have tried to go back to Mitch and have him chip it in headed away from Hernandez there at the top of the six and San Antonio FC will keep possession Shannon Gomez the header won here by Orange County. It's Lucas! Great save from Shuttler, the first test of the evening. And Ashton Miles with a nice little bike getting it out of there. A little pressure here from SAFC now. Lambert. His service is defense. You're fighting for time. Very few substitutions, obviously. And so that'll take us to halftime as we're nil-nil at the break. We hit Hernandez over the ball. We're going to drop a diamond. Looking in Tanner's direction. Heads it down. Marie is there. Big time save. What a spot there from Hawkinson on him. Finally, they'll open it up. Fox. I think that last transition in for Orange County. That switch could have happened a lot faster. It doesn't need to hit four people's feet to get to the other side. Dunbar, good luck! And saved by Cisniega, and finally Orange County. One hour into the match, breaks through with a shot on target, and tests the keeper. Bar doing what he loves to do. He likes to take on one-on-one. -on -one. He takes a hard 90 into the middle of the field to get a good look at the goal. This time he goes low 90, no good from Cisniega. Declined there. And, uh... Just playing that outside winger really well. Shannon Gomez looking at that back post and no one in a vicinity to play it. Orange County turn it upfield and we get a slow to stoppage. But Hawkinson doing good to pressure anyway. You know, he didn't say, oh, it's I'm not gonna get to that. He got up there, pressured it, made the the build out of the back really difficult. Uh, Coach Marcina had said, man, I wish I had like 10 of Luke Hawkinson because it's that kind of stuff that he does well. Shannon Gomez gives it up and is able to win the ball back and then he gives it up again for a second consecutive time. That sets Solosky off. Top of the box finds Zubak in his sweet spot. And a save from Cisniega. Among with a post up there. He's able to escape. Simply, he's got a chance to switch, and he does. So that opens up a little bit here for Orange County. They look inside the box. That's defended out, and that will conclude the match. As we finish nil-nil tonight at Toyota Field.